bigger footprint than the last generation. It also comes with serious off-road chops and of course the luxury driver and passenger experience. Like its competitors, the GX460 is aimed at buyers who want to be treated like royalty, even if there are seven people in the vehicle. Of course, the folks in the third row might be a little cramped. The same could be said of the mid-sized luxury SUV segment, so Lexus opted to go where the buyers are and lower the price by $3,000. Because what we're seeing in that mid-luxury segment, a lot of that growth is in the lower end of that mid-luxury segment in terms of the price. Mm -hmm. By being able to reposition the GX, we definitely are able to open ourselves up to a lot more sales opportunity. Of course, what you get is a familiar powertrain. The 4.6 liter dual overhead cam V8 engine is rated at 301 horsepower and 329 foot-pounds of torque. It is mated to a six-speed automatic full-time four-wheel drive transaxle. Fuel economy numbers are comparable to some V6 engines in similar sized platforms. Of course, the GX460 comes with the Lexus luxury handling. Considering it weighs more than 5,000 pounds, the response is more car-like than we expected. On the open road, it finds the sweet spot between a floating ocean liner and a performance sedan on the Autobahn. A few years ago, Lexus was the dominant brand in the mid and large luxury segment. But times have changed, and the company has to compete harder, bringing more for less and to a lot more drivers. This is Greg Morris. We want to know what you think, so email us. The address is bumper to bumper TV at cs.com.